Hey everybody, Justin from Lake Murray Aerial again, and today we're going to be taking a first look and unboxing at the Turnigy Multistar Elite Motors. These are the 4006 740 kV version uh, that they just released. Uh, up until this point, Multistar Elite line has been just the real high kV micro motors for your 250 class racers, and uh, they had this strange 8S optimized uh, like endurance motor. Um, that's a real low KV. I don't, I don't even remember it off the top of my head. Anyway, uh, this is the first mainstream one. I think these are going to be real popular because you know no one's really flying 8S yet. Not many people anyway. Um, so they come in this white cardboard box, which is a departure for the Multistar line. Uh, they used to come in the nice metal box like these. This is a different one. Uh, not an Elite, but they came in this nice uh, tin box. Uh, if you're expecting that, you're not going to get it, but big deal. It's just a package. Uh, so let's open it up, take a look. And inside you have your bag with your prop adapter and all your hardware. And here is the motor itself with some nice length uh, motor leads here. Those are pretty good. 18 gauge, and they have the bullet connectors pre-soldered on. That's a nice feature. Take a look at it. Pretty nice looking windings, as multi-stars tend to have. And the Japanese EZO bearing, which looks to be of a pretty good size, a little bit big, bigger than uh, most motors this size. There's your logo. So it is that new darker green color uh, of the Elite line instead of the bright green that were on the old Multistars. I actually happen to have one right here, so we put them side by side. And that's a regular Multistar, and that's the Elite. So we bought these motors to replace our old Taro 4006 motors on our Taro 680 Pro. Uh, I have those right here, one of them right here, so we can kind of compare. I think a lot of people are flying this motor on the 680. It, it, you know, it's Taro's motor and it's like the recommended size. And they're a good motor, um, but these have been getting real hot for me uh, recently. You know, I have a lot of payload on my 680. I have those two candy droppers. I got a gimbal and a GoPro. And uh, with some payload, when I put stuff in, the 680 uh, candy dropper modules I've been getting over 4,500 grams. So these have been getting hot and I'm just concerned about how long they're, they're going to be able to run. Uh, they've been developed in some shaft play and I think it's just time for them to get put out to pasture so to speak. So that's why I bought these. Um, these multi-star elites are supposed to be all about efficiency. So you know they're a little higher KV, 740, which is kind of counterintuitive to efficiency usually, but we're going to see if we can't get any better flight times out of these because that's what multi-star elites are all about. And obviously, if you're flying a 6A, you know, the mounting pattern is different. These use that triangular 27.5, I think, uh, millimeter. These are more standard. I already checked, though, with the uh, 680 mounts, and these will fit fine. So that's your first look at your Multistar 4006 740KV Multistar Elites. And it looked like a nice motor from the first glance. So we're going to get them mounted up on our 680, do some test flights, and find out. So that'll be the next video we put up. Thanks for watching.